Hi everyone, uh, today I'm going to show you how could I make this um, panel or rectangle piece. I'm going to use them in one of my future projects. I've made one of them, so dimension of approximately 50 cm length and um, about 20 cm wide. Um, so I I uh, have cast it on 150 stitches. So 150 is my favorite number because I think that's perfectly fit my body measurement for 50 cm and that measurement would give me a lot of possibility so I usually go with 150 stitches um, and this is the pattern that I'm using right, the pattern called for a repeat of 10 uh, and then 6 on both sides um, that would make in my case because I need 150 stitches um, then probably I need 13 repeats of 10 in the middle that make 130 stitches and then 6 on this side 6 on the other side that make 142 I still need to cover the rest of 8 stitches so I did um, 4 plan double crochet on both sides uh, what I did to demonstrate the, 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 the pattern here uh, let me put it uh, on top of that so we can still see how it looks right. this is what I have done I made I've made uh, 150 chains um, I usually confuse between chains and stitches because I do both uh, knitting and crochet but anyway I, I think you would pick out what I did is I make I made 150 chains and then I do one ring for round I mean that optional so that ring for round is technically a double crochet uh, right, three double crochet, one chain, three double crochet, one chain. That to have you a uh, um, little bit of um, strength. Alright, and now I'm at the end of that reinforced line. I'm going to incorporate the pattern. Um, so let's say I'm here. So now I'm go. I need to do my my four double crochet first. Right. I'm going up three chains and then I do four double crochet. One, two, This is the pattern without the four double crochet at the end of both sides. Now I'm adding them. That's mean I need to modify it a little bit. So instead of making at um, six change, going to make three. Then I go down to the the fourth one. Then I make one. Um, Single crochet, then I do five change, lay four in between, and one single crochet into the fifth one. Then I keep continuing doing five chains, one single crochet into the fifth one. Right, and 
still the end. So let me show you. I make three chains. So instead of um, six, I make three. I go down to the. This is the first, second, third, fourth. Now from now on, I make five chains. One, two, three, four, five, and then I leave four chains in between. Just to crochet into the next one. Then I'm, I will keep doing like that till the end of the row. 